at the tone. Please record your message. Hey, love. I hope you've been listening to the weather. I've been trying to call you, but I'm not getting through. And all my texts only have a single tick. The rain has already started, and the news said flooding started a few towns over. If I remember correctly, that's where you said you were going to an urgent meeting. I'm just calling to find out if you're okay. Please call me when you get this message. Love you. Hey, it's been a couple of hours. Your mom called me. She said she was trying to get to you, but it went straight to voicemail. Give me an update when you can. Hey, sweetie. Are you okay? There are landslides. Cars are getting stuck and roads are being blocked off. How far are you? Get to me as soon as you can, please. I'm worried about you. Sweetie, I'm, I'm really worried. I'm thinking your phone is dead, but I'm sure you told me it was full when I asked you to check this morning. I'm just hoping you're okay. Your mom's power is out. I think it's going to go out here soon. They said the storm is going to get worse. I'm waiting for you. I hope you're safe. I love you. Hey. It's 1 a.m. The reports are getting serious and I have no idea where they are. They hate the thunder. They must be scared. I, I don't even know if they're coming home alone. God, what if they were trapped on a highway with a massive landslide? I'm sure they're on their way home and, and they're fine. No, but, but what if they had to abandon the car and cross the waters? They aren't a good swimmer. No, what if, what if there are fallen light poles in water? What if... Babe, babe, is that you? I'm coming, I'm, I'm getting a towel. Jesus, you're drenched. Come in. Here. Let me dry you off. I've been calling. I thought I was gonna have to go out there to find you. Your phone is dead. How? You were trying to call me and it fell in the water? Oh, that kind of dead. Did you abandon the car? No, no, don't apologize. That's the least right now. We can deal with that later. I'm just glad you're safe and with me. I thought about how scared you must have been. I know you don't like thunder. Let's get you changed off. Hey, wait a second, you're limping. Let me look. You have one shoe, what happened? You were just trying to get to the door? You have no idea how this happened, huh? It's alright, love. I'll check your feet when we get to the bathroom. Just want to make sure you have no injuries. You might not have felt it. You have all this adrenaline pumping and you were only thinking about getting home. You getting a cut or anything may not register. 
Yeah, even now. No, don't take another step. I'll carry you. You poor soul. You're shaking. I think a warm bath and some chamomile tea will do you well. Alright, sit down so I can check. Aren't you a lucky one? Everything looks good enough. It just looks like a step on some stones. When you get showered, I'll put some ointment on it. Let me help you with this damp clothes off. You can take the hot water before it decides to go away. I'll help you in. I'll go put your clothes and towel in the towel warmer so you can be comfy when you get out. Okay? Comfy? <laughs> Good to see you're getting settled. Here's your tea. I just know you're exhausted. Of course, you can snuggle up next to me. Are you hungry? I could make you something to eat. You don't want me to get up. <laughs> Alright. I'll stay for a little bit. But then I'll get up to make something for you to eat. Deal? Good. And next time, no matter how important the client is, you're not doing this again. It could have been so much worse than it already is. Still good you got it. But it's not more important than your life. That's how you're gonna pay for the car when you see it trash tomorrow? Is it that bad? <laughs> Don't even tell me. I believe you. If they say you have it covered, I believe you, boss. But really, that's the least. I'm just so happy you're safe. I love you too, baby. <laughs>